A 2,000-foot asteroid is set to pass by Earth Monday morning, and if you don't catch it now, you'll have to wait more than a year to see it again. But you are going to need a telescope to see the annual space phenomenon, astronomers say. The asteroid named 2013 NK4 orbits the Sun every 378 days, according to NASA. The space rock has an elliptical orbit that takes it past the orbit of the planet Mars, and in between the orbits of Venus and Mercury. The asteroid is slated to safely pass by Earth at 10.51 a.m. Eastern Time, NASA is reporting. It is set to pass the Earth again next year on April 23rd at 7.12 a.m. Eastern Time. No, you will need a telescope to see the celestial body, NASA says. Although the closest approach for asteroid 2013 NK4 happens on Monday, due to its location in the sky, it'll be easier to see the space rock when it's dark on April 16th and 17th, according to EarthSky.org. The asteroid, the outlet reported, is nearly twice as large as Apophis, the so-called doomsday asteroid set to pass closer than Earth's artificial satellites in 2029. An asteroid discovered Tuesday, April 9th, will make an extremely close, but harmless, pass by planet Earth today, April 11th. Asteroid 2024 GJ2 is roughly the size of a car and, since its discovery this week, astronomers have calculated that the space rock will graze by Earth at a mere 12,000 mile, 19.3 thousand kilometer, distance. That's just 3% the distance between the Earth and the Moon. 2024 GJ2 measures between 2.5 and 5 meters, 8.2 and 16 feet, according to the European Space Agency, ESA. This means it's an asteroid with a weight class that would have burned up in Earth's atmosphere if its orbit happened to intersect ours more directly. Astronomers believe the asteroid's closest approach distance to Earth will occur at 2.28 and 42 seconds p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, 18.28 and 42 seconds Greenwich Mean Time. On Thursday, at a distance of 11,600 miles, 18,700 kilometers. That's closer than some geostationary satellites in orbits, just over 22,236 miles, 35,785 kilometers, above Earth. The next closest flyby of 2024 GJ2 won't occur until 2093, according to ESA's Near Earth Objects Coordination Center. When that happens, the asteroid won't pass nearly as close as it will today. GJ2's 2093 approach is estimated to fly as close as 127,970 miles, 205,947 kilometers, to us, 10 times further than today's flyby, and just over half the distance between Earth and the Moon. NASA has cataloged nearly 35,000 near-Earth asteroids to date, though very few of those pose any threat to the planet.